Hi, I'm Richard. Welcome to the Gellert Showroom. Today, I'm going to teach you the best way to pitch your Amiga tent and pack it away. So, to start things off, the first thing you should have in your bag is your tent. There's also a pump and pegs. So, let's unroll your tent and get ready to pitch it. Once you've selected the perfect place to camp, pull out the four corners of your tent, taut, and then take your peg and mallet and start to peg out each of the four corners individually. When pegging out the four corners of your tent, ensure the webbing loop is fully loosened, take the peg, place it into the middle of the loop uh, and make sure it's at 45 degrees to the ground. Then hammer in the peg. Once you've pegged the four corners of your tent out, now it's time to inflate the poles. At this point it's helpful to have somebody to assist you. Uh, just lifting the tent in, inside. So, firstly, select one of the two middle poles to start inflation. Take your hose, push it in, that's a friction fit, into the valve, uh, then you can start inflating. These poles are designed to be inflated up to a maximum of 5 psi, but anything from 3 through to 5 is acceptable. It's also good at this point to have uh, a friend help you just by lifting the fabric weight inside for the first pole. Once you've fully inflated your poles, now's a great time just to let them sit in their natural position by giving them a tug out. What you'll find is that the tent sits in an hourglass shape. This means that in the living area you've got extra head height and in the bedroom area you've got extra width for all your stuff. The next important point to note is each of the poles has an access door placed uh, down here at the base of the tent. These all need to be fully closed up. Uh, this will keep your tent nice and dry if it does rain. Before pegging out the rest of the tent, ensure the doors are unrolled and fully zipped up. You now need to go and peg out the rest of your tent. To do this, take the adjustable uh, pegging points and loosen them fully off like so. Then place the peg inside the loop at 45 degrees to the ground and hammer into place. Once the guy lines are pegged in, these can be adjusted by pulling the tensioner towards the tent like so. Then you need to tighten the adjustable pegging points around the base of the tent. Once you've finished pegging out your tent and the guy lines, it's fully ready for you to enjoy your camping holiday. When you're ready to take your tent down, take the guy lines out, unpeg all the adjustable pegging points apart from the four corner ones. Then you need to start deflating the poles from one end of the tent. So choose your end and go to the access door down here. If you unzip this, you can gain access to the valve which will deflate the tent. Once your tent's fully deflated and the final four pegs from each corner have been taken out, you can now fold up the tent and start to pack it away. To do this, take the corners from either end with a helper and pull them into the middle. When you're ready to roll your tent up, it's a great help to have somebody just keeping control of the edges and stopping them billowing out. So take the ends of the tent in two hands and start keep rolling, keeping them very tight as you do so. Okay, when you've finished rolling the tent, the final little bit of air is escaped, you're ready to put the rolled tent back in the bag. Then place the pumps and the pegs on top and you're all done.